welcome back to signal boost and I'm just out here in my backyard on a fall late fall evening in November watching the sunset it's actually not even quite five o'clock yet um, I stopped a little bit early today just because I had finished up what I had to do and the air is crisp it's gorgeous I'm thinking about doing a sunset eye at sometimes sometime soon because I'm just enjoying these golden late fall sunsets and looking forward to more fires. We have a fire pit that we have been using every night because we have this enormous wood pile because we got rid of a tree. So we have been having fires every night and it's been really nice in lockdown just to have something daily that we can look forward to, just something relaxing that would have been special before, but now we're here. We have nowhere else to go and nothing else to do other than the million things inside the house and taking care of the kids and doing our jobs and, and cooking and uh, cleaning after more mess than we've ever had before um, since they were babies maybe. So it's just really nice to have a little ritual every night or almost every night to do that. Um, I did want to share an experience I had the other night. I decided to actually leave the house, which I'm not doing much these days because the numbers are super, super high right now. But anyway, I left the house to just put on a mask and go to TJ Mask. TJ, <laughs> my daughter was like, are you going to, to PJ Masks? And I'm like, no, TJ Maxx. It's so similar. So anyway, I went to TJ Maxx with my mask on, of course, and try not to get close to anybody. And uh, I just love looking at the makeup there and the skincare and see what they're there. So I bought, up some, bought some uh, just face masks and facial spray and things like that. But I was so awkward. I don't know how I'm going to reintegrate after quarantine is over because I was just so awkward. Like at the checkout and I just was like fumbling with my wallet and like I left my card in the thing and I had two different orders. I was paying with two, through diff two different methods and like... I forgot something that was in my card and it looked like I was shoplifting what I wasn't and it was just a disaster and I think the um, cashier at the beginning was pretty understanding she was kind of giggling and at the end she just was like oh my god just get out of here lady and uh, anyway I also went to one of my favorite consignment places around here just because it's a really relaxing place to walk around. I feel like I'm, when I'm in a regular retail store, I don't know, I just don't feel as relaxed. But when I'm in a thrift store, I feel like, man, all walks of life, you know, I feel just comfortable and it's, I love looking at interesting treasures and things, just weird things. Uh, anyway, it's kind of like one of my happy places. So I was in there and I, I got there about 20 minutes before it closed and the little speaker came up, you know, we'll be closing in 20 minutes. And I don't know what happened, but my heart just sank. I just all of a sudden my eyes welled up with tears and it was kind of like it was the one time I was in a place that I felt safe and comfortable that wasn't my own home since quarantine and I was actually by myself and I didn't have anybody talking at me and I didn't have the obligations piling up like right in front of my eyes and I was like oh okay so I just got here and in 20 minutes this is just going to be inaccessible, inaccessible to me. And it's just all the stuff that I've been bottling up about being in quarantine and, and being frustrated and being overwhelmed and everything just came over me. So anyway, I just wanted to share that just in case you are also feeling like you have um, run out of resources in terms of, you know, just been out of practice for social interactions and that your emotional resources are much lower well you are in good company my friend because that is me too so anyway I hope in the next couple of days to have a little bit of new content makeup wise for you because I'm getting some little Pat McGrath mini lipsticks and something from Melt and a third thing. I don't remember. I ordered something else. But anyway, it's coming and you'll get a little demonstration. Remember, I don't do reviews. I just do introductions. 
And uh, so anyway, if you have any questions that you want to ask me or you have any recommendations for things that I should try, especially products that aren't on the major sites, um, let me know and I will see you next time. And I love you. Bye.